Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from the College Woman's Cookbook of 1923, we're gonna be making the tomato club sandwich. Mmm. First thing we gotta do, toast some bread. While the bread's toasting, we need to add mayonnaise to chopped ham. It does not say how much on either. You might say, Barry, is that really enough mayonnaise? <laughs> Hang on. And welcome back to another patented Sandwiches of History voiceover. Uh, the battery died, didn't let me know. <laughs> Good times. All right, so we put our ham and mayonnaise mixture onto some toast. You might be saying, hey, Barry, where's the tomato? Boom, tomato, and of course, more mayonnaise. And yes, it said to spread it onto the tomato like that. Another piece of toast, another slice of tomato, and of course, more mayonnaise, this time in a dollop. And then we get fancy with a little ring of green bell pepper. Okay, let's give this tomato club sandwich a go. It's actually pretty okay. It's a little bit mayonnaise heavy, um, but the tomato and the green bell pepper and the ham, it's all working pretty well. I do want to plus it up a little bit though. I'm going to use Slap Your Mama Hot Cajun Seasoning Blend. It's going to go well with the ham, mayonnaise, the tomato, mayonnaise, the green bell pepper, and of course, the mayonnaise. Okay, let's give this tomato club sandwich plussed up with Slap Your Mama Hot Cajun Seasoning Blend. Ooh, ow, chum, chum. That works really well. Uh, it turns out that Cajun Seasoning Blend works well with green bell pepper, tomato, mayonnaise, uh, ham, and yes, even toast. I know, most people don't think it goes well with toast, but it... It really does. I'm gonna give the original tomato club sandwich a six and a half, I think. Five and a half, six and a half, somewhere in there. I don't know, it was really good. Plus up with the Slap Your Mama Hot Cajun Seasoning Blend, that's like a seven and a half. I don't know that I'll make it again, but I'm definitely gonna finish it today, cause hey, it's lunch. Well, that's all I can remember. See you tomorrow.